Jay Grazio with Shooting Illustrated, here with another entry in our iCarry series, bringing you firearms and gear devoted to home and personal defense. Today, we have a CAR CM9 9mm in a Blackhawk Tech Grip holster. We also have a Blackhawk spare magazine carrier, a 5.11 tactical flashlight, a steel well gecko folding knife, and a Filster first aid kit. Let's take a closer look at this gear. While it's tempting to think the CAR CM9 came on the scene in response to other single stack 9mm semi autos like the Smith & Wesson Shield or the Ruger LC9, remember that the PM9 upon which the CM9 is based was released in 2003. The CM9, like the Shield, was released in 2012, a year after the LC9. As an everyday carry pistol, the CM9 size makes it eminently concealable, but perhaps its small size is why it is often overlooked. It is somewhat of a handful to shoot a full power round out of such a tiny pistol. The CM9 really is tiny, 14 ounce weight, 5.4 inches long overall, and less than an inch wide. It's barely larger in size and weight than the Smith & Wesson Bodyguard 380, yet it's chambered in 9mm. Capacity is 7 rounds total, slightly less than larger single stacks, but on par with Micro 380s. And in either case, hardly a deal breaker, especially for a pistol that fits easily in a pocket. Two drawbacks to the small size that should be addressed, however, are the position of one's hands while shooting and the act of reloading. For those that favor a support hand position far forward on the pistol, be mindful of where your support hand thumb rests. As with most pocket size pistol, reloading is more complicated than with full size pistols. The strong hand tends to capture the magazine and it will most likely require the support hand to remove. The CM9 borrows heavily from the established PM9 with minor differences in manufacture and aesthetics. The CM9 has traditional rifling rather than the PM9's polygonal and has engraving on the slide rather than a roll mark. What remains the same though is the diminutive size and ease of carry. This is definitely a full power pistol you can carry every day. Introduced a couple years ago, Blackhawk's Tech Grip line of holsters feature three layer laminate construction with a sticky outside, smooth inside, and closed cell foam in the middle. This keeps the holster firmly anchored in the pocket, allows for a rapid presentation of the pistol, and gives a good measure of protection and comfort when the firearm is holstered. While Blackhawk promotes this line for inside the waistband carry, I prefer my IWB holsters to have a secure belt attachment. They work exceptionally well as pocket holsters though. If you're downsizing your carry firearm, Obviously space is at a premium, so a small flashlight like 511 Tactical's TMT PL is a great fit. At 3.2 inches long and an ounce and a quarter in weight, it's extremely easy to find a spot for the TMT PL in any pocket or bag. While the 24 lumen output isn't going to blind anyone or light up an entire football field, it's entirely adequate for scanning around your car or lighting a walkway. One AAA battery powers the TMT PL for three hours and it is weather and shock resistant. Blackhawk liked the Tech Grip idea so much, it got expanded this year to include magazine carriers. Built with the same specs as the Tech Grip holster mentioned earlier, the magazine carriers can also be carried inside the waistband or in a pocket. I don't have a problem carrying a spare magazine inside the waistband without a clip, and the Tech Grip works quite well to keep a spare tucked away. When carried in a pocket, the extra wing on the carrier helps separate the Tech Grip from the magazine on the draw. The Gecko series from Steel Will incorporates Makarta scales, single hand opening via a thumb stud on either side of the blade, pocket clip with ambidextrous possibility, and simple lockback mechanism for keeping it open. The N690CO cobalt steel blade is 3.5 inches long, and the Gecko measures 7.87 inches open. Weight is 4.76 ounces, and other finishes and handle options are available in the Gecko line. We've talked about the importance of an individual first aid kit, often called IFAC, previously at Shooting Illustrated, and while it's pretty easy to pull together a decent kit to lash to a range bag or bug out bag, having a minimalist kit you can have with you all day long is harder. Fortunately, Filster has done the heavy lifting and put together the PEW, the Pocket Emergency Wallet. With a Snake Eater Tactical Elastic Sleeve, the PU contains a pair of nitrile gloves, compressed gauze, a compression bandage, and a sheet of wound clock gauze. As always, we recommend professional first aid training to best use this equipment. But having it on your person at all times means that even if you're not fully trained, someone with the right training won't need to waste valuable moments searching for life-saving gear. As an aside, I wanted to say thanks to Lucky Gunner Ammo for the stocked Filster Pew. For more information about this gear and other everyday carry combinations, visit shootingillustrated.com. And as always, stay tuned for more gear on iCarry.